Welcome. Cancers. Um, happy Valentine's, Cancers. Happy Valentine's. All right. Um, let's first see the people who you're dealing with in the spirit, Cancer. Past life relationship. You have known each other from past life, and this is wonderful. Um, a lot of you um, are dealing with an Aquarian, Gemini, or Libra person, and you have known each other from past life. Uh, this person is back. Uh, I see they recognize uh, the lies and deceptiveness of a, a young Aries person. So justice is coming down on this young Aries person. Now, is this your partner? Who is this person? Is it the ex? Is this your partner? Um, I see they recognize something about this person. So this Aries person could be coming up uh, as, you know, different Aries, uh, the spy sign person, sorry. Um, I see an Aries. It could be an Aries. It could be a Leo. They're going to be recognizing. And I see um, you're going to be justified. Um, um, I, I see divorce could be coming up for uh, some of you cancers because of some sort of a lies that was created. Uh, a Virgo. I see a Virgo is uh, deciding to, um, you know, leave a relationship behind. Um, if you're in a relationship with a Virgo, I see this Virgo is going to be deciding to leave a relationship behind. Um, divorce is coming up. Um, ending divorce if uh, some of you are in a relationship uh, with a Leo you're going to be divorcing the person moving forward mm -mm 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 -mm. they're going to be recognizing that a Aries Leo or fire sign person um, some of you could have been involved with this person um, could have taken you down for a whole lot of money. So cancers, whoever this person is, um, they're going to be recognizing. Okay. Bam, 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 bam. So six of ones. The energy of the six of ones has to do with um some sort of a positive news is going to be coming in from a Virgo, whoever this Virgo is and whatever is transpiring. Um, and whoever this Virgo is and the news that is coming in from a Virgo, um, it's going to be very, very positive. Okay, because this Virgo is going to be recognizing some sort of a play um, that was um, happening. And it's a situation where a lot of you um, are going to be recognizing... A Virgo is going to be recognizing that a Leo tried to make some sort of a um, false move and people recognize who this Leo is and what this Leo was doing. Then we recognize that an Aquarian, Gemini or Libra, a lot of you know this person from a past life. A lot of you have been in some sort of a relationship with this person and they're going to be finding out you know, that you have been seeing this person for a very long time. They recognize some, a Gemini is going to be recognizing that a fire sign person was very dishonest. Um, new vitality is going to be coming in. I see people are going to be reconnecting with some sort of a past relationship. Um, you have known this person from another lifetime and this person is going to be coming back to you this um and it it, it is uh, whoever this person is is going to be coming back um to a lot of you or if you're dealing with an aquarian gemini or libra person uh who, okay so the eight of cups the eight of cups is about an ending and whatever this ending is so an ending is here for a leo justice came up on a leo and recognized what a Leo have done and how a Leo have created some sort of a um, dishonest play. Okay, so um, whatever and whoever this Leo is, I see they're going to be recognizing that this Leo 
I've gotten some sort of a document, uh, you know, whoever this layer is, is, uh, um, you know, I've, I've taken a lot of money on the false pretend and that's not the Leo. Whoever this person is, is not, um, the, the, you know, has really taken, uh, someone for their money. So it could be a divorce. A lot of you cancers could be divorcing. A Aries or a Leo and they're going to be taking you for everything that you have a lot of you in getting in this marriage a lot of people have advised you to take a to sign a um, prenuptial agreement you didn't do it and I see that an Aries and a Leo is going to be taking you for everything that you have cancer and you know cancers this is the thing about it is that uh, being sensible, you know, being sensible. A lot of people is not recognizing that you go and you have this relationship with the wrong people, whatever. You know, fire can change the mood of anything. They can manipulate you because you're water, you know. And when you guys recognize that, hey, but, you know, the thing about this, and I think that this is why all the changes is coming up on this planet, a whole lot of people have to be re-educated. A whole lot of people needs to be re-educated because I think that this is where um, education is a key because we were born, but we were born with uh, without knowing who we are, okay? And uh, who are the people that we should connect with? And this is why there is so much astrology, blah, blah. blah. If you have a fire sign and if you are a cops to a fire sign, okay. But if you're not a cops and you have nothing um, to get up with a fire sign, you got to recognize because you're a cancer. So you are bordered with the Taurus and the Gemini. Now, um, it is, uh, your opposite sign is the Capricorn Tauruses, but um some Capricorns just don't want to deal with your cancers for whatever the reason is. And it's um it's shady in that area because you are supposed to be the marriage partner to a Capricorn. And a lot of Capricorn is like, whoa, no. And a lot of um a cancer is like the opposite. So, so it's a sort of a balance, but you gotta recognize fire sign people. It is not your cup of tea. And you cancers are always connecting to fire sign people when you have, uh, um, you, you know, and especially you're going with, you're supposed to be with uh, the earth sign people because you're a cancer. So the Tauruses, the Virgos and uh, Tauruses, Virgo and Capricorn. You are the opposite sign for Capricorn. So relationship, friendship, and that sort of a thing uh, is, you know, what it is. But yet still, if you are looking for a relationship, that is it. So I see um, a, a transition is coming in where a lot of you cancers, uh, um, some sort of an end is coming in because whatever is transpiring, a lot of you cancers are recognizing some undesirable game that was played and how um, they're going to be recognizing that you cancers have, uh, you know, see, you know, end with an Aries, a younger Aries than you. And this person is your wife. This younger Aries than you is your wife. And I see that this person is going to be asking for a divorce because this person thought, um, and it's going to be recognizing that you lied to them. Okay. So I see a lot of uh, issues, a lot of problems and situation that is transpiring. So I see the energy of justice and justice is standing where I see a lot of divorces, divorces with, with Leos, divorces with Aries. Aries recognize that their husband, their wives, has been lying. Um, 
end is coming up for Leos because uh, people recognize the transition with relationship with Leos. Um, and, you know, a lot of people are uh, deciding to end. Uh, see, the end is coming up for Leo. So as you look at it, some sort of a divorce and the end is coming up for Leo. So a lot has been happening and transpiring cancers and cancers. You're going to be recognizing um, that a whole lot of issues, a whole lot of problems that you have been dealing with. Uh, this situation is going to be coming um, around and you're, you need to face this. It's as if, uh, um, you know, affairs that is going to be coming out um marriages that is going to be breaking down and you have to face it you just have to face it however way you just have to face it um i'd love to have you on the other side if not um just just move along just you know make the decision and move along because i see aries is going to want to divorce you cancers um, a, a lot of you cancers is going to be divorced and a Leo don't want to have anything to do with this person recognizing that the Leo was just a, a, a gold, a, a gold digger, um, recognizing that a Leo played you with a Pisces. Uh, so all of this is going to be coming out. I do love you guys. Show your love by thumbs up. Let me know how it goes. Namaste until next time.